Hello everyone! Okie dokie, leave a like on the video. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, earlier today, the 17th of October, 2018, lads. Still got a squeaky chair, but regardless, uh, a new scan, or this is called, this. well this has been referred to as the Winter 2018 Xenoverse 2 update. And... Yeah, I don't think any of us was expecting this. So, of course, very quickly, you can see this is in black and white. It's not an issue with your monitor, with your phone, your TV, wherever you're watching this on. Yolkan Productions, who posted everything from V-Jump, for some reason, this is... Well, he posted this, and it's in black and white. I don't know if it's actually... If it's like an issue on his end, or if it was because of the fact that in V-Jump itself, this is actually in black and white and grey, whatever. I don't know, so I do apologise there, guys. Uh, but yes, yeah, so earlier today, before this scan came out, I'd say about two or three hours, maybe four hours, before it came out, uh, it was leaked. Well, this is a leak, but I mean, it was uh, revealed like in text, like websites and stuff that people have, you know, from people who have the magazine, that this would actually be something coming to Xenoverse 2 in the winter update. And that is, it's a new mold called the My Raid mold, which of course you can see here, it's going to be a 5 versus 1 online. And we knew that it was going, well, you can see here in these three pictures, right, oops, my bad, in, oh, come on. <laughs> in these three, oh, I want to die. <laughs> in these three pictures right here, um, oh, go away, whatever, I hate that. Um, uh, there's three new characters that are going to be playable for us in this, I'm guessing just in this new raid mode, and those are from the left. And again, it's not the, I, I want to die, I hate this so much, so I'm not going to click. Uh, you can see here on the left, it's corrupted merge as I mostly got the grotesque form. Very nice. Here it's first form demigrade right in the middle right there, which is very nice. And on the right, it's final form mirror, or rather terror absorbed mirror. So that's really, really cool right there. Uh, also, very quickly, you can see right here in the bottom uh, left, go click there, great guys back, awesome. Uh, actually, can I just um no, I can't. Okay, whatever. Um, you can see here, at uh, the bottom here, uh, two new outfits coming. I'd assume it'll be, well, one new outfit for both male and females. And that is, I'm guessing it's just going to be called the Santa outfit. Great. <laughs> Dim, us to Dims, we want Hits outfit. Dims, have a Santa outfit. <laughs> Wonderful. Fantastic there, lads. So, yeah, something that I don't think... Well, something... When we found out about... This, uh, yeah, this new mod earlier today. We were just thinking, oh, it'll be like the raid characters, like for example, well, here, you know, from left to right, corrupted merge on Masu, first form Demigra, and then uh, final form slash terror absorbed mirror. But you can see right here, guys, the Xenoverse 2 mask guy, like the um, protagonist guy, like that they've been using since the game was very first revealed, like the what, uh, not white head, um, the uh, blue head, I guess, Sane slash Earthling, whoever he is. Um, Kak, he's using the villainous mode transformation. So, does this mean we're gonna get a new transformation for our avatars for this specific mode? I honestly don't know. So, if well, I'm gonna probably put it in the title saying, uh, "Oh, new character, well, new uh, avatar transformation confirmed." Well, not confirmed, but um, leaked, whatever. So, if this turns out not to be true, I do apologize, and I will then later, of course, change that. But this is the cutscene, and. Well, I mean, I would assume it would be because, well, yeah, you can see in this screenshot right here, uh, yeah, I'm, I don't want to keep clicking. In this screenshot right here, you got the, um, it's like from the player's perspective, you can see there's the uh, avatar, you can see the heads up display, the hood display there, uh, well, hood display, well, heads up display, well, uh, <laughs> sorry guys, um, you can see it right there, it's, it's the character, so it is, that, this is what, this is like actually being controlled by a natural person, you know, by a natural player. And you can see the, like this little cuts in here when you use the villainous mode transformation, or rather, like, like I guess the super villainous mode transformation, or whatever. So I'm guessing this might actually be a brand new transformation, and if so, I would then assume it's just going to be for this specific mode, the My Raid mold. Um, yeah, honestly, that's cool. I like that. Um, it does look like here that it's the timer is just going to be like three minutes long because there the timer's gone to one minute and. I can't see what it is, but it does look like though. Also, that 
Well, in all these screenshots showing off like in-game, uh, you know, in-game footage of this new mode, it looks like them all on the time rift stage. So I do wonder if that means that this is the mode. Well, this is a stage that you go to when you use the mod, which I mean, I wouldn't mind because well, actually, it probably would be. Let's be fair, because it's open. You, you can't really cheese in it. Well, it's just like a yeah, a completely open uh, space. We've got stages such as um, uh, the glacier stage. Maybe comics look at to some extent, and Namek, where it's like, you know, like a massive stage, you could kind of cheese it, I guess. I mean, we don't know how you win this mode. Is it just, um, like, if, if no one gets the KO, does it just go to how many KOs each team has got? In which case, it would, you know, presumably, you know, presumably be the person who picked, um, you know, who picked the um, raid boss. So, yeah, it's very interesting. And also, guys, because of this, I do want to do a low budget food moveset, which will probably be out tomorrow, uh, which will be the 18th of October 2018. And I want that to be a low budget boss raid food moveset. So, guys, with that said, you know the deal, you know the cack. Leave your suggestions in the comments of this video, and I'll use the best ones for that video, and I'll show the comments off in the video and stuff like that, and it'll be a fun time. But this is what I'm thinking. So, I can't remember when they said this, but this was about a year or so ago. They mentioned that at some point, I think they said it just before or just after DLC 4 came out, or maybe even DLC 3, I can't remember. Not Extra Pack 3 or Extra Pack 4, like, DL, like Dragon Ball Super, DLC 3, and of course, Dragon Ball Super or DB Super, as it's officially called, uh, Pack 4. They did say that they want to, or they will consider putting all like the raid exclusive rewards, the world tournament exclusive rewards. I think that's that's all they yeah, they, they only said the last two things in like the TP Metal store at some point in the future. So I wonder if this is gonna be a way they do that. So by that I mean if you go into this mode and you win, you're then getting you know you'll then get maybe some sort of unique currency called I don't know RP raid points. I, I don't know. Ow. Um, and then you can use those to then um you know, to then uh, buy the previous World Tournament and Raid exclusive rewards, such as the Kefler Week, which I missed. I'm so annoyed I still missed it. Well, I'm still annoyed I missed it. Uh, the Golden Great Ape Outfit, the Merged Zamasu Outfit, and the Zeno Outfit, and this goes on and on and on. The Janemba, uh, the Janemba Sword, so not the Janemba Outfit, which I still don't have. Uh, the Janemba Sword uh, right there. Uh, but yeah, um, honestly, I mean... I, I want to know why. I want to know what this screenshot is right here because this is definitely in-game footage. Like, you know, it's taken from in, you know in-game. You can see here, like, it's got and again. I know it's in black and white. I have no idea why. Uh, a few people asked on Twitter saying, "Oh, is it supposed to be in black and white? Who knows?" Um, but you can see, like, it's got the villainous mode aura or the super villain mode aura, what it's called. Um, so I wonder if this is going to work similar to how uh, Awoken, such as purification turn giants and stuff of like that work in the sense that when you use it you then have a different moveset i do wonder because this is very this is interesting i'm very intrigued about this uh no release date right now um but what's also interesting is that there's nowhere nowhere in this scan so far Look, this is the v jump for well it's v jump for december 2018 yeah it's like the, the like they've like a few months ahead or something on v jump or whatever but of course, it was released in October 2018. I don't know why the goal like two or so months in you know ahead in advance. I just don't know. Um, but there's no way here in this scan that would that like as far as I can see that suggests or even mentions Broly or Gogeta being part of the next update. Now, of course, this is this if this is going to come out. Well, if this comes out this year, it actually you know what? I don't think this is going to come out this year. It's not going to come out this month. And I don't think it'll come out next month, and it won't come out in December because every single DLC for Xenoverse 2 so far has came out on like what uh, the 27th or something. So like around the 27th of a given month, so that would mean that um, this will have to come out around like the holiday season. I guarantee you won't do that, unfortunately. So I'd assume this will come out in February of 2019, which I mean, <laughs> okay, great. Would prefer it come out sooner, but you know what, whatever. So it could actually be the final update, who knows. Uh, I just hope it doesn't come out in February, because that's when V, uh, v Jump, that's when Jump Force is, um, that's when V Jump, uh, why do I keep saying V Jump? 
That right, to the V Jump characters, that's when Jump Force is currently scheduled to come out. We don't know if it's early, mid, or late February 2019. We just know that as of right now, it is planned to come out in February of 2019 at some point, lads. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think. I don't think there's anything else um, here. Uh, yeah, I, th I think. I do actually think that's it. Uh, yeah, very interesting. I'm pretty much. I'm, well, it, it is the transformation, of course it is. Like you can see it here, but I'm guessing it's just going to be for this specific mold, the my raid mold. Guys, with that said, thank you ever so much for watching this video. I do hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you. Actually, I'll see you later today for year number six. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.